Aeronavics produces flying robots that carry equipment through the air for a variety of industries. In 2010 we started our company called Drawdrooks at the time. Within a week of going online we had the first distribution request and, and that grew from there onwards. This is a, a really exciting technology. It really offers a lot of um, a possibility. The drone market's about $12 billion today and it looks to double over the next five years. When we look at the drone market, there's three primary segments of that. The military, commercial, and consumer. We're focused on the commercial area and, and that makes about 25% of the market. We target four industries within that. We look at agriculture, utilities, film and media industry, and then government services. One of the primary industries that is taking on this technology is agriculture. It's to have that eye in the sky and being able to see what goes on rather than having to jump on that quad bike. It saves a lot of time and keeps people safe. Looking primarily at agriculture and, and primary industries, very conservatively, $160 million will be saved per annum just by the use of this technology. Another application, for example, is industrial inspections. We see the mining companies and the oil and gas power companies for infrastructure inspections. Mapping and surveying, creating 3D maps of properties and, and building sites. The film industry is how we started. We know that our systems have been used for producing the Twilight Saga, for example. Recently our drones have been used in, in cricket matches to film the, the match from different angles. MasterChef is being filmed with our equipment. The Formula One uh, moniker, the start of that was live broadcasted with our equipment. Another application that is really upcoming is the emergency services. So in the bushfires, for example, in Australia, the technology is being used. This market really requires robust and reliable technical solution, also a lot of support. So those are the aspects that we focus on. We make really good systems and we offer really solid support. So yeah, we're looking at this incredible opportunity. We're getting so much demand from so many different directions uh, and we don't quite have the resources to, uh, to develop them all through. The current offering we have with Snowball FX, uh, we're targeting to raise $750,000 with a cap of up to a million and a half dollars. Now we've been transiting from being an airframe manufacturer to a turnkey solutions provider. We are now ready to roll out with our turnkey solutions worldwide. In the short run, our focus is on delivering our new product range. So we've, we're investing heavily in tooling. We're developing additional media and promotional collateral. We're focused on building the back-end manufacturing and production capabilities necessary to deliver. We've got a couple of advantages that really give us a really good position to be one of the top players. So we have a large uh, global distribution network already. We've already got a number of partnerships with different application vendors uh, who provide sensors and software and other hardware. It's already a trusted brand. People know the Droidworks and the association with Aaron Evers is getting stronger and stronger. We believe this is going to be a fantastic opportunity for investors. You know, besides your return on investment, just to being part of this movement is exciting but also really meaningful. And we've chosen the Snowball Equity Crowdfunding as a platform to give the opportunity for the public to become part of that.